Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. PlayStation VR Killing Floor Incursion Part 2. And let's get started. I, I might have messed up that one. Come on, go back. Oh yeah, well, I do want free one. Mode solo. Let me finish. We're almost there. I can get it done. I'll get it done. Last stop, Lieutenant. Every other server has crashed, but thanks to you, we're still online. We need to get this simulation cleaned and rebooted, or a lot of people are going to die, including you. That reboot should stabilize everything after we clean the virus out. Problem is, that will not be easy. But hey, what has been easy today? Speakers sound okay. Gross looking. This is a recreation of the biotics lab where Horsey made its first cloning breakthroughs. It was all meant to be for the greater good. And then the patriarch. Uh, have you lost anyone, Lieutenant? During the London outbreak, I was outside the city. But my sister and her daughter, she was only five. Now I help Horsey and train soldiers like you to take those bastards down. Anyway, I really look forward to meeting you when you get out. Current info on what Horsey is doing in this lab is restricted, but um, I have a feeling these tentacles are part of it. They're everywhere. I'm gonna make it hard to grab a weapon. Surprise, surprise! The door is jammed. Probably more infected code. Emma. Really not friendly. Lieutenant, there's a terminal we can use up ahead. You'll need to hack the security system to get the rest of the doors open. Don't worry, I've got a fiendishly clever plan for that. Oh, hang on, there's some grenades on that desk. What is it with Colin and high explosives? Looks like babies. Roadie. 
You need to find the hard drive in there with the Z physiological data on it. Load it into the hard drive reader on the table, and you'll be able to use Z parts to bypass the scanners. Best I can do without easy access to your medical files, thanks to the virus. There are a few hard drives scattered around. It looks like Colin ran this last and didn't clean up after himself. For heaven's sake. It's like working with a child. Well, I don't see you around, lady. Is it? Have you found the data? Try putting any drive you find in the reader. It has to be one of them. Open your eyes. I'm not asking for something particularly difficult here. Sorry. Sorry, Lieutenant. Just been a stressful day. I know you're doing your best. I don't see no hard drive around. It may be hidden in a box or under a hat or something. Because that's where normal people keep hard drives. To strangle you. Once you find the hard drive, put it in the reader on the table. Hard drives scattered around. It looks like Colin ran this last and didn't clean up after himself. For heaven's sake. It's like working with a child. Have you found the data? Try putting any drive you find in the reader. It has to be one of them. Open your eyes. I'm not asking for something particularly difficult here. Sorry. Sorry, Lieutenant. Just been a stressful day. I know you're doing the best. the Z parts in there with you. You should be able to use them to get out of that room. Sorry for locking you in with dismembered Z bits. It was the best way to make sure this crazy plan is gonna work. I know it's gross, but it's what you have to do. Grab the Z-arm, put it on the hand scanner. Grab the Z-head, hold it in front of the cerebral scanner. That will open the door. We really don't have time for squeamishness. Uh, 
Ah, uh, whatever. Where's the head? You need to suck it up, sunshine. Sorry. Sorry. Lots going on. Just grab the arm and that skull and get through that door. This whole thing could crash and kill you any minute, and you're worried about some digital blood. Put the hand on the hand scanner and the head on the cerebral scanner. Alright, I don't need the axe. There we go. Hello, everybody. I don't think you want to die today. Pick up the Z arm near the boxes and the head across the room. Put the Z hand on the hand scanner and hold the skull in front of the cerebral scanner above it. Do it now, Lieutenant. Time waits for no man, and neither do computer viruses trying to lobotomize you. Get away! Let's move, let's move. Get ready, boss. This is the big show. The whole reason you're here, and I'm a giant head. You've got to get the ZDNA stored in the master control computers way up at the top of the containment room. Which means you're going to have to kill whatever's in that room. I guess that explains the tentacles. You can't shoot something that big into the great beyond with pistols and shotguns. And I've got nothing. We'll figure it out as we go, I guess. Hopefully, Colin left us some clues. Enough! 
I'm done playing with you. I am your master now, the supreme being. You will deliver the vile matrix data to me. My patience is limited, Lieutenant. But Emma's suffering is not. of evolutionary dead ends. to lower the elevator. Get to it, mate. That will look super gross. Can you shoot the bile? With a try, at least. Maybe if you can put a lot of pain into the tentacles or the head, it will distract you. Good work. The elevator is heading down. Sorry to crash your party, Patty. Usually I meet your clones at bullet regifting parties, so we don't get many opportunities to talk. How you been? How the kids? Hurry, get on the elevator. It only gets worse from here. You barely wow. made it.
reroute power into that doohickey above that horrible monster by opening the hack tools on this level. Doohickey is a technical term. Look it up. Doohickey does something that will hurt it a lot. Grandmother. But really, what did you expect from Mr. I replaced my arm with a chain gun? Get up to the next level. Looks like the elevator's no go, so be creative. Come on.
kind of looks like a pill. I hope it's not a suppository. Right out of the middle. Look, it's a simulation. It's not real. There isn't gravity. Just a program that acts like gravity. And programs are just numbers and syntax. I'm seeing more code in that bridge than is visible. Trust me. And you need to get it out. Yep, you're good. Can you try and look extra tasty? Maybe shake your meaty bits out. together the data you've collected throughout this whole freaking ordeal. Hard part's done. We've just got to get over the goal line and we're through. We'll spit out a hard drive with the data any second. You may not want to listen to me, Lieutenant, but Foster is as much your enemy as I am. If you don't believe me, listen to Emma. Listen, the thing about Foster, he's... He's not what he says he is, Lieutenant. Foster set this whole thing up so he can sell the Zed data. It was his virus that removed the safety protocols, and he was the one who clubbed you over the head. He's not your friend. Plus, crashing the server will kill everyone, relying on it for life support. Hundreds will die if you give the data to Foster. Put the data in the reader on the right and then press the button. That will reboot the server and keep the data in Horsine's hands. Not out there in the world, making everything worse. What are you... Look, some people will die if we crash this server, true. But this info will help us save thousands, if not millions of lives by turning the tide against the Zeds. Yeah, it's a tough break and a terrible decision to make. But you need to put that drive in the reader on the left and push the button if you want to save the world from being zettified. Look at the monitors. Those people are the ones you will be killing. People just doing their jobs. Please, the Patriarch. He's right here. Please, if you give that data to Foster, I am dead microseconds later. His gun is to my head. Don't kill me, Lieutenant. Put the data in the reader on the right and press the button. Save me. I don't know which one. Screw it, I'll do this one. You need to send the data to me now. Good choice, Lieutenant. You've saved scores of lives. But only for today. I was never on your side. You should have listened to your friend, Mr. Foster. Did my screaming sound convincing? How about my thank you, Lieutenant? Or, you're so awesome, Lieutenant. <laughs> the Patriarch is going to return my family to me. And then he will elevate mankind. We will be part of his new world, thanks to you. The Patriarch will lead us to a new era. The boss will be by to uh, finish your surgery shortly. Goodbye and thank you for your help, whoever you are. Good choice, Whoa. fool. Congratulations on bringing me the blueprint for the destruction of all mankind. Now all those people you saved can serve as food for my own vile matrons. I can already hear the cacophony of their screams. So sweet. Soon, you will join them. Goodbye, whoever you are. 
My children will come for you shortly. I choose the wrong one, but you know what, I'm going to do that one more time and skip to the boss, see what happens afterwards, choose another one. So I'm basically going to give you both endings. Plus, crashing the server will kill everyone relying well, on it for life support. Ending. Hundreds will die if you there give the data go. to Foster. Put the data in the reader on the right and then press the button. That will reboot the server and keep the data in Horzine's hands, not out there in the world making everything worse. What are you? Look. Some... Ooh. Good job. I'll be waking you up directly. See you in a few. After all I did to help you, and you betray me, you imbecile. Who do you think my boss is? Did my screaming sound convincing? <laughs> How about, thank you, Lieutenant, or you're so awesome, Lieutenant. The Patriarch said he could bring my family back, that we could be together again. Now, now you've ruined everything, you stupid buff! Just a tick, mate. I'll have you free in a sec. The Patriarch is here, so I'm using the chaos from the virus to get you out. Not part of the original That's plan, but... Me, I'm, guessing. Hey, I'm not really one for plans. Hope you're ready to run and gun as we're going to have to fight our way out. You did a real good job. That data is going to save the world. When we get out of here, those beers are on me. These are the credits. No creepo. I guess we can skip the credits. Well, this is then a video. PlayStation VR Killing Floor Incursion Part 2 Drop a like, comment, subscribe Subscribe would be much appreciated And I'll catch you guys on the next video Laters